Hello everybody, Marilyn here. How are you all doing? I'm doing fine. Well, fine. Not really, but hey. <laughs> there are worse things than that I uh, am dealing with right now, but I've been stuck at home since Monday. Um, I all of a sudden have sciatica and uh, it hurts so much. And as I have a standing job, it's a little hard. So I decided to stay home and I'll see. Uh, I had therapy yesterday uh, and traction. That is one heck of an experience, I gotta tell you. But it felt better afterwards. Not now, my leg hurts, but that's okay. I'll get better hopefully soon because. Um, I don't like this at all. And even though I love being at home and being able to craft, I don't like to miss out on my paycheck. So, I have a couple of things to show you. Uh, since, I don't know, a couple of weeks, I am a member of a new Facebook group. Canadian Paper Crafting Swappers. And um, as it says, Canadian, it's only for Canadian people. And I really like that because um, there is a lot, of more, a lot more groups that I'm a member of. And there are some people in the U.S. that don't really want to ship to Canada because it's too expensive. Well, believe me, Canada Post is more expensive than the U.S. Uh, even shipping something here in Canada can be very expensive. But, anyways, um, I really like this group. I, whoops, sorry, I participated in one swap already. And um, this is the second one that I participate in. And this is actually, it's cute. It's a mystery four pocket pocket letter. I love that idea. And uh, it's done even faster than a nine pocket, of course. But it's it's so it's so fun. It's totally different. Only four pockets. So I used um, Doodlebug So Punny line. I uh, I swapped a pocket letter with uh, Rebecca, I am Mama24, and I received hers and she received mine, but I really liked what she did, and I kind of stole her idea, um, like the fine paper lines, uh, paper lines, pen lines around the cards, I really like that. And uh, I uh, I used this banner was in there. I have the uh, chit chat. That's this is apart from the chit chat thingies, and the odds and ends are these peppers, a piece of bacon, the egg. It's just adorable, and this is a cutout from uh, the paper pad. So. Uh, I really liked these peppers and I used a mini uh, doily by Doodlebug. I'll just jump back and forth because I have a couple of things to show and these doilies came in yesterday. I ordered them at uh, Simon Says Stamp. Um, they are adorable. Um, I don't think... Well, it says food safe, great for crafting, and there's 75 in a pack. It doesn't give the size, but I just had to cut off a very small piece, so it's a little wider than three and a half. So, three and a half inch in diameter, probably. And it's adorable. So I wanted to use the yellow one. This is the bumblebee. And I also got, of course, purple. 
because that's my favorite color, although they call this lilac. But I think I paid $3.99 for 75 doilies. Well, that is a lot, right? And there's more on my wish list because there are 12 colors and um, Simon doesn't have all of them, but there are more on my wish list. I want to have pink too and the, the, the lime green or this swimming pool kind of color. I love those. So, okay, I got those. Then uh, I did this, the banner, and I uh, cut the other banner out of paper, just a little uh, longer than the Hello Love one. And uh, I so do think you're cute. I really like that. Cut it out, um, added some uh, foam tape on the back, and added a strip and a rectangle in different colors. And these two peppers, they say hottie. And this one, this one just cracks me up. I know Rebecca had one of these in my pocket letter and I love it. Don't go bacon my heart. I couldn't if I fried. I mean, right? Cute little bacon strip. Cute little egg. So fun. Now all I need to do is uh, add some goodies and I have all these fibers. I really love this one. And this yellow one. I always try to uh, match the colors <coughs> of the papers. And now Doodlebug has all these cute bright colors. So I figured pink, green, yellow and blue they're all in uh, the paper. So I figured I'd do that and just pull it through. Sometimes I use fibers, sometimes I use I make a paper tassel but I think this is kind of cute, right? This um, washi is also by Doodlebug. Ah, this looks kind of cool. So, that's the pocket letter. And then, um, this is what I ordered too at Simon Says Stamp. See, Simon Says Stamp. Craft Tacky Glue. And it has an extra fine precision tip. So, as you can see, it is a very fine tip. I used it with uh, gluing these uh, paper pieces down. It is amazing. It's really good glue. It's really a precision tip. And what I love is that you can like put it down on the lid and there you go, always ready to go. And phew, I don't even remember what I paid for this, but it was not expensive. I would say it was between uh, two and four dollars maybe, maybe not even. You know what, I'm sitting behind my computer, let's just have a look if I can find it fast. Uh, tacky glue and I <laughs> moved my uh, keyboard so that's a little hard to type now. Craft Tacky. There we Oh, look at that. It's only $1.99. Isn't that awesome? I love this glue. I always has, have that pen that I use, but uh, this is even more precise and a, a smaller amount of glue that comes out, not big blobs. Now I don't know how much. Oh, 60 milliliters. Sorry for the glare, but it's so dark and gloomy out there. See? Yeah. So, $1.99, Simon Says Stamp, if you would like it. Um, then, that's what I got. I got the doilies. And I ordered... I already put it away. This paper line. 
by Lori Whitlock, Echo Park Paper Company. Um, Doodle Bug is my ult ultimate all time favorite, you know that by now. But Echo Park, they have yummy stuff too. Um, this is the whoops, I'd rather be crafting kit. I had to have that. Uh, it has uh, 12 double-sided papers in there. Um, 12 by 12 sheet of element stickers. And as you can see here, some papers have uh, the cutouts for that you can use for flipbook or whatever, album, I don't know. But here are the double-sided papers, buttons, sayings, I think, letters, flowers, um, this is for sewing, kind of cork, uh, orange, and text, a ruler, scissors, a pen, a pencil, a uh, brush, um, plaid, cameras, now let me turn it around like that, Cameras, like a kind of wood thingy, typewriters, flowers, phone and glue and whatever kind of stuff is on there. And these um, squares or diamonds and this orange one. And as always, I have the ephemera that I got at Snapclick Supply. So I'm going to do... Uh, I'm going to swap uh, memory decks cards with uh, someone and of course I'm going to do a pocket letter but um, um, speaking of memory decks cards <clears throat> this is an all-in-one video okay uh, I had the Fashionista paper line by uh, Echo Park 2 and I had made a pocket letter with that. I'll make a video because she uh, hasn't received it yet. I haven't sent it out either. We're going to swap like mid-April. Um, so, And I, I just wanted to make uh, memory decks cards with it. So, shoes speak louder than words. Soulmates. Oh gosh, my flash turned off. Damn. Can you still see it? I hope so. These shoes. I added some tool here. And the Love It Heart. And this one. I love this thing. The only BS I need is bags and shoes. Isn't that awesome? So like, oh, very high heels. Also, high heels. And this cute little bag. And I added some pearls here and another Love It heart. And, well, I, I don't shop that often for clothes. I hate clothes shopping. i rather go craft shopping. But I never leave the store looking like this. But you had me at sale and that's what happened. She went out and got herself some nice stuff probably. I just added uh, some uh, pink bling and an eyelet in here that kind of matches the paper. So that is what I did with uh, these. And I really like how they turned out. Three more in my collection. Let me know if you want to swap. I would love to. Um, I'm going back to the pocket letter because I don't even remember if I said it, but this was a mystery for pocket pocket letter. So your partner doesn't know what she's going to get. And I kind of like that idea. And uh, as I'm always doing swaps here, I was kind of thinking of doing an anything goes kind of swap. Also mystery um, when you sign up 
you and you contact your partner you can always ask what uh, she likes what her favorite color is or if there's anything in particular that she likes so you can kind of um, make something that you know she will like but I kind of like the mystery idea so I'm going to think about that. Let me know if you would like that, a swap, like anything goes, mystery kind of pocket letter swap. Just leave a comment below and I'll uh, see how many people would like that. So that's everything, guys. Thanks so much for watching and you all have a wonderful day. Bye.